Hello, my name's Emma and I am a care and support broker and I joined in August and previous to that I was in a very different industry. I worked in travel and tour operating. Following COVID and the effect of the travel industry, I was looking for a new opportunity where I could um, utilise all my skills. And one of the things that I've noticed is that I came from a very target-based background. I worked to sales targets and customer KPIs. And here at West Sussex, it's a very different environment where the focus is on providing the right package of care for each individual. My industry experience was zero and my experience of working for a local authority was also zero. But don't let that put you off. Um, I would say that my manager is very supportive and there's a lot of different aspects to the role of care and support broker, but I, I'm not expected to know every single one and be up and running straight away. I'm learning each responsibility in turn. It's a very supportive team environment. I can ask any member of the team. In my team, there's about um, seven or eight care and support brokers and they're always willing to help with any questions that I have. I would also say that in terms of the training, initially I've got a, a six month training plan and it's quite detailed and it's a mixture of online learning, webinars, shadowing colleagues, asking managers and learning on my own and working on my own initiative. And at any stage, my manager is always very supportive and I can always ask her if I've got any queries or any issues. I would say that moving to West Sussex, Learning all the processes is going to take me time, but I know that I'm not expected to know all the processes overnight. And as well for me, coming from outside the industry, um, I've got to learn industry processes and acronyms. And I know that this is going to take time as well. So in terms of my transferable skills, these were a good way to show that what I could offer for the role and the fact that I felt that I was a good fit for the role. So whilst I was lacking in industry experience, I felt that I had a lot of transferable skills to offer. For example, working with suppliers. So here at West Sussex, we deal with a lot of external providers and I've already started creating relationships and having regular communication with these providers. And I can talk about working with um, internal different teams as well and starting to develop relationships with the internal teams. Project management is an area where I can utilise a lot of my transferable skills, such as communicating. That's a key part of the role, uh, both verbally and written. And we communicate internally with providers and with members of the public as well and their families. Time management. I would say that it's a fast paced environment. Priorities can often change and we respond accordingly. And we work sometimes to quite tight deadlines as well as we've got projects with sort of longer deadlines. The ability to work on your own initiative as well as being part of a team, they're both equally as important. I think you have to be quite organized because there's quite a few different responsibilities going on at the same time and be able to prioritize your workloads. And also customer service, I would say that that's quite a transferable skill. We deal with customers and their families and we provide support to them as well. And also IT skills as, as in any role in any sector are quite transferable. I, I started in August, so I'm, I've already started to develop relationships with all our providers and I've found this really rewarding already. We have a customer database, so I'm learning um, how to use and work my way around that and that's mainly through on-the-job training. And then the one thing that I, I already mentioned is that it is fast paced, but it's a really variable role. No two days are the same. And I actually came from quite a similar environment and I feel very comfortable with that. And I would say as well that it's a really supportive team. Thank you.